In this lesson, we'll conclude a review of Math Test 9, Section 4, Calculus Permitted. We're on the last two gridding questions, 37 and 38, and this is a paired question. Both questions relate to this information. The table above shows the number of international tourist arrivals rounded to the nearest tenth of a million to the top nine tourist destinations in both 2012 and 2013. So let's take a look at 37. Based on the information in the table, how much greater in millions was the median number of international tourist arrivals to the top nine tourist destinations in 2013 than the median number in 2012 to the nearest million? And so we're just looking for the difference in the median from 2013 to 2012. And thankfully, if you look, these are all in order like sometimes they'd be mixed up and then you have to kind of arrange them but this one's already in order right 83 we're going down down this is the lowest same with 2013 and we know there's there's nine and we talked about a median question i think in the last video nine's an odd number there's one median so that means there's eight left so there's four on either side so we just want the fifth term that would be the middle and they're all in order so one two three four five it's going to be italy Right, that's right in the middle. And we want to basically just know what the difference between 2013 and 2012. And so this would be 47.4 minus 46.4 to the 10th of a million. And remember with decimals, right? So this would be the 10th. If we had another number after this, it'd be 100th with a TH. And that's it, it's just 1.3. This is a pretty straightforward question, I thought. That is the answer. And one more question, last one, also dealing with this information. The number of international tourist arrivals in Russia in 2012 was 13.5% greater percent greater than in 2011. The number of international tourist arrivals in Russia was K million more in 2012 than in 2011. What's the value of K to the nearest integer? So we don't have 2011. We have 2012 for Russia, and it is 24.7 million. And this number is 13.5% greater than 2011, which we don't have. And we first have to figure out that number. And then we have to see what the difference is to the nearest integer between the two. So we've talked about this with percent questions. We don't have the starting value. We have the ending value. And whenever you have a question working backwards with percent, the starting value, we'll call it x, is always 100%. It's the original. And then after the change, we know that this is an increase because it went up 13.5%. So think about the original value, just think about it as a decimal is always one, so starting value. We have an increase here, so this is gonna be 1.135. If it were decreased, we'd subtract from one. So once you recognize this is 1.135, the last step is you always divide. Always divide to work backwards, and this is gonna give us the value for 2011. So it's 24.7 divided by 1.135. So 21.76 million. 21.76. So we went from 21.76 to 24.7. And the question is saying, asking for the difference of k million to the nearest integer. So that just the nearest whole number, not tenths or hundredths in this case. So it's just going to be three. It's very close to three. It's just a tiny bit less. And so the answer is three.